Hello, my name is Erica Bisa. I'm from the United States and I am a junior group leader here at the University Hospital in Heidelberg. Our lab works with a small fish called zebrafish and we work with them because they have a remarkable ability to regenerate their heart. So after a heart attack or an injury that mimics a heart attack, those fish can completely replenish that um, injured tissue with cardiomyocytes, um, which are the functioning cell types of the heart. Um, so we're really interested in understanding those mechanisms so that we can develop or better develop therapeutic strategies to help um, adult human hearts after heart attack. Heart disease and heart failure is a problem that um, affects our society today. And we hope that through our work that we can better develop therapeutic strategies to help humans after heart attack to better patient quali or quality of patient lives and to reduce the burden on our healthcare systems. Zebrafish is a really remarkable fish species. So they're, you know, this small, and when they're embryos, they're actually transparent, and so they've been used for decades to understand mechanisms of developmental biology because you can really image them um, easily because they're translucent. I've been working with zebrafish since the beginning of my postdoc, so I started in 2015 working with zebrafish. Um, and I haven't changed yet, so. so. The academic opportunities in Heidelberg are amazing. Um, you know, it's a very small city with a big density of, of a lot of different scientific groups, a lot of different scientific directions. Um, and there's a lot of collaboration. So we have a lot of cross collaborations with different institutes within the university. You have the clinic, so there's a lot of translational research going on. You have the EMBL, so there's a lot of basic research going on. And so um, the academic opportunities here are really, really good. We, our group is part of the CRC 1550, so this is um, a collaborative consortium of about 16 different labs that are funded by the DFG. And so we all work on one um, theme, which is molecular circuits of heart disease, and we collaborate with all of those labs, um, or some of those labs, um, in our projects. Um, in addition, so the, the Health and Life Science Alliance in Heidelberg and Mannheim, which is funded by the state of Baden-Württemberg, um, gives us a lot of opportunities and a lot of funding for these cross collaborations. So we have, for example, funding to work with um, the multi-space hub, so looking at spatial um, omics techniques, and also within the uni clinic, so here at the university hospital. And so there's a lot of um, promotion of inter-institutional collaborations, which for us has been extremely fruitful. What I like about living in Heidelberg is that, you know, you have this big city feeling, but the city is really small. So I can get anywhere by bike in about 10 to 15 minutes. Furthermore, you're really close to the nature, so you walk 10 minutes and you're, you're in the forest, um, but it's still really vibrant international city and, and that's what I really like about it. The state of Baden-Württemberg, um, I think they put a lot of importance on, on science and basic science and, and science with translational potential, and I think they're putting a lot of funding into, um, you know, um, supporting junior group leaders and, and junior people starting their own labs um, and that's been really great for me.